Okay, okay, relax, relax, relax. Okay. I just want to say that, you know, thank you for making tonight happen. And um, as cliche as it sounds, but um, just appreciate life, man. And um, yeah, one love, man. Yeah. The top photo did some our very first performance and the bottom foot our very last performance in 2019 Is it the same concert when you got injured? Yeah Sound quality isn't that good Prior to my accident I I played in this band called Harvest. We are a three-piece band. Uh, we play sludge, doom metal. I play the bass, and I do vocals, and um, two of my, my best friends, Sanjay, he plays the guitar, and Chi Tian plays the drums. I can't play the bass, so, um, yeah, I don't play with them anymore. I just want to ask, like, what do you miss most about like, performing? It's a feeling that uh, I can't explain. It's full on therapy. Yeah. Do you ever have dreams? Uh, yeah, I definitely do, but again, um, realistically speaking, I don't think it's going to happen. So what happened was, I slipped off the stage and um, I fell on my back and that led me to having this spinal cord injury. Yeah, it's just unfortunate. When the doctor told me that I had um, stage four lung cancer, I was told that um, I have about plus minus three months left. So, um, why I call it one for the road is, um, you know, I want to do it one proper one before anything happens. Yeah. It really means the whole world to me. Yeah. I would give up anything and everything just to play music again. Yeah. Mama shop. <laughs> Mama shop. Mama shop. Hey. Hey. You eat your cup for drink inside. What shop? What shop? Hey. Give me that, man. Hey. 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 The local music scene has groomed me a lot and a lot of the bands have given me a lot of opportunities to do things that I have always dreamt of as a child. So doing this concert is a form of giving back to the music community. I think it's also a night for everyone to be able to give thanks to music for existing in our lives.
Today is gonna be a good. It's a good day, man. Yeah, man. Yeah. Weather's perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Gentlemen, going to grab for you? Yes, sir. When was the last time you were here? That was when I got my spinal cord injury. Many people asked me, like, uh, are you sure you wanna go back there? Is it gonna bring, you know, like, bad memories or whatnot? I'm like, I'm not gonna let something like that stop me from doing something that I want to do. So yeah, psyched to be back, man. It's gonna be sick. Hello, my friend. How are you? Good to see you, man. You're It's just like, like, like two verses, which means like quite a lot to him. Yeah, it's actually the second song we wrote together. Yeah. Then you know, profound love that part. Uh, mm. Till the day I fade away. Yeah. Yeah. But I don't know why I like scared. Till the day I fade away. You need to. Yeah. You need to. Because the last more. show, like Mel told me, like, oh, from the next release, you're gonna be doing like 50% of vocals. Cause I used to do like maybe 20%. And it's like 50% and like, oh yeah, it's stoked. Then, oh, that, that, that didn't happen. Yeah. So, um, probably later, I hope I can make him proud. Mainly, that guy has to be super happy and we are just contented with that. Like, yeah. that's the only thing that matters. So, I guess, for you and Titi and Trout, the day you all just um, no, we'll, test, we'll, test we'll out test the... First. Yeah. I think the main thing that I would want to achieve from this concert is to be able to pull it off smoothly and for everyone to enjoy themselves. I think that's the most important thing to me. Other than that, nothing else really matters. Yeah. Okay, everybody just uh, kind of like, uh, nah, hey, everyone fall in, fall in, fall in. I'll wait for Mel to come in, then I'll make a short announcement before we have the first one. So, can we get uh, the band start on the stage? So, now, Physically, you are not here, you are not able to join fellow bands on stage. But for sake, I'm going to make sure that you will be on the stage as part of the as part of the gig for tonight. Okay. Can we have the Kua banner? And now, this is you showing the scene what a f***ing badass you are. Right and you are not going to be, you may not be going to be you don't with your friends and 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 friends Man. We appreciate you. Appreciate our friendship. It's got it forever, man. This is profound love. Let's go. Who know the words? Come and see you with me.
I think the concert went amazingly well. It wasn't what I was expecting, especially the amount of people that were there. Knowing that so many people actually are supporting me in the shadows, that was really really nice but the main highlight of the concert was just seeing everyone enjoy themselves it's a uh, it's something money come by yeah besides my family and friends without music with all these injuries and diagnosis I think I probably wouldn't be here right now. I think for most people, they would agree with me that if music did not exist at all, life would be completely meaningless. Music changed my life. Thanks, Atika. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so Mel, how do you feel now that the concert is over and done? Um, I'm sad that it's over. Um, I wish I could do something like that again. Honestly, after the concert, it was pretty tiring. You know, um, just recovering from all the hours of uh, spending the day there. And, um, you know, just because of my chemo as well, you know, I've been recovering from that. They can't really tell how much it's actually helping. I mean, I wouldn't say they gave up hope. I believe that they were trying their very best to find some sort of treatment for me. But um, I choose to believe that it's helping me in some way or another. No matter however long that I have, as long as I'm still here, there's always a chance of it being even longer than anyone thought it would be. One thing for sure is that um, I don't want to die. And um, that is something that I have actually wished for growing up. I just hated everything. But with this diagnosis, it really made me realize how one shouldn't take life lightly and I really just want to do everything that I can and try to hopefully leave a legacy. I don't know how 
big that it's gonna be, but you know, I just want people to remember me for the the good things I've done. Yeah. I hope he gets well and able to move so the three of us can get together and play again once again. Mel, I love you so much. Thank you for everything. You've seen the worst and the best of me and I wouldn't have had it any other way. Thank you so much. We really love him a lot and we are very proud of you for where he's come. Moving forward, we hope that he will face everything positively yeah, and always be happy. We love you so much, Mel. Yeah, we love you so much. Mel, I, you're doing great and like you've always been in our hearts and in our minds. Yeah, regardless where we are in the world. So, yeah, we'll be with you throughout till the end. Huh? I love you, Mel. Fight harder. Stay strong. Thank you for doing the show for everyone in the scene. You know who it is. Uh, like, we've been around for a very long time and I love you, brother. I just want to say to Mel, just keep on doing what he can because I believe if you have a will, you can survive, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, all the best for everything and I'm here. I'm always support him forever. Yeah. Gross. And, and thank you for all the gift of friendship yes. and music that you've shared to everyone. Uh, and yeah, that has touched everyone, including us, you know. Yeah. So it's definitely something special and yeah, we're always here to celebrate Mel. Yeah. It's crazy how you are organizing this whole thing while going in and out of like the clinics and stuff like that, the hospital and working at the same time at on this job, at his job. It's just crazy how you're doing all these things right now and um, we love you and thank you for involving us and thank you of us to be part of this and yeah I think I think for us I'll speak for all of us when we say like see him on the other side like. because this journey is not over we just, he's just going first yeah. we'll see him later for sure but it's going to suck I tell you first <laughs> <laughs> we know it's going to be he's going to get it better but you never know what <laughs> you never know what I always like to say there's yeah. nothing like certain in life and death yeah. so yeah. before the day comes let's not, let's not get there yeah uh, we love you, Mel. Yeah, we love you, yeah, We love you, Mel. Although I will never say yeah. it to you, but yeah, we love you, Mel. I think you get to tell, right? <laughs> <laughs>